Thank you very much, Apex people. I am glad to see you here. And uh, this is a wonderful event organized by Dr. Ayaz, one of my senior Iqbalian, and uh, his uh, very worthy team. They're doing very wonderful work for the Alama Iqbal Medical College alumni. And uh, this is an annual event, and you can see this is houseful. Inshallah, uh, everybody will be enjoying this event. And uh, as I said before, as a Iqbalian, I am very much uh, impressed by the, uh, the level of uh, uh, participation and involvement by the uh, Iqbalian doctors here in Manchester. And being a Manchester Mancunian, I am the one of the hosts as well. So uh, thank you very much, Apex and uh, Dr. Suhail. Thank you very much. Alama Iqbal Medical College ka aaj ka ye jo function hai iska buniyadi maqsad college ke tamam sarkarda doctor sahiban ko yahan ek acha platform muhaiya karna hai inshallah ye mulk ko qoum ki behtari aur tarakki mein madadgar sabit hoga hum mashkoor hain ke media wale isme apna kirdar ada kar rahe hain bahut shukriya assalam alaikum dear iqbalians I'm Dr. Aisha Naveed, a psychiatrist and secretary, AIMCA UK. Assalamu alaikum. I am Dr. Irfan Rashid. Uh, I'm the event management committee lead for AIMCA UK. And uh, I'm a general practitioner as well as pediatrician. Assalamu alaikum. Uh, I'm Zafar Hashim. I'm a secretary for AIMCA UK and I am a radiology uh, registrar. We take this opportunity to welcome you all to this prestigious event. It is indeed your kind presence that will make this event a success so that we continue to meet each other as a family and achieve the desirable goals as an organization. We would like to thank you all on behalf of AIMCA UK for taking time out of your busy routine. This event marks the third annual reunion of Iqbalians and first anniversary of AIM per UK. We have worked very hard and are determined to work harder to make it an even more successful organization. We certainly hope and believe that you will enjoy this evening. We would now like to invite Dr. Yunus Parvaz to first of all recite a few verses from the Holy Quran and also to offer Fatiha for the late Professor Iftikhar and our dear medical students who have recently passed away in a tragic accident. <laughs> Principal by Professor of Medicine, Alama Iqbal Medical College. Hal hi mein humse juda hui. Dr. Shakil Safdar, Dr. Ambar, aur pichle hafte jam haq hone wale do aziz talaba un sab ke liye darajat ki bulandi aur maqsad ki dua ki darkhastah milke dua karte hain. 
اللهم صل على سيدنا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وبارك وسلم الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين اياك نعبد واياك نستعين اهدنا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين انعمت عليهم غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين امين بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله احد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا احد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله احد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا احد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله احد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا احد يا الله يا رحمان يا رحيم يا حجو يا كريم برحمتك استغيث عرب کریم ہم نے جو مل کے قرآن پاک کی تلاوت کی ہے اس کو اپنی بارگاہ میں قبول و منظور فرما بالخصوص ہم سب مل کے ہم گرا گناہ ہو کے یہ دعا کرتے ہیں مولا کریم پروفیسر ڈاکٹر افتخار احمد صاحب کی روح کو ان کو سکون پہنچا ان کی درجات کو بلند فرما اور جو باقی ہی زو اکار ہمارے دوستوں عزیز و متوسلین رفائق اکار کی کوئی والدین بہن بھائیوں کسی زوکار میں سے جو ہم سے بچھڑ چکے ہیں ان سب کی اروا کی مقصد الماء صلی اللہ تعالیٰ علی خیر خلق ہی محمد و آل ہی و اصحاب ہی اجمائیم Can we please request Dr. Usman Khan, consultant surgeon and a very important member of AIMCA UK, organizing committee to come on the stage and formally welcome our guests Starling. Dear ladies and gentlemen, Iqbalians and their families, on behalf of Organizing Committee of AIMCA, I welcome you all to Alama Iqbal Medical College Alumni UK's first anniversary. It is my great pleasure to welcome our chief guest, Professor Shahina Asif and her husband Chaudhary Asif. Professor Shahina Asif is an eminent gynecologist and obstetrician. Other dignitaries present here are Sajid Mahmood Kazi, community welfare counselor who is here representing Pakistani High Commissioner and we are very grateful for him to come over here. Doc Dr. Nayar Abadi, MBE and Deputy Lieutenant of Greater Manchester. We also welcome heads of different alumni, Dr. Shahid Bashir, Chair King Edward Medical College Alumni UK, Dr. Tajamul Khan, Executive King Edward Medical College Alumni UK, Dr. Zaman Kazi of Khaber Medical Alumni uh, Khyber Medical Association. One year ago, the AIMCA was lodged on 22nd June 2013 at Iqbalian's annual dinner in London. The primary purpose of the organization is to provide a forum for graduates of Alama Iqbal Medical College residing in the UK and collectively engage in professional and social activities and establish academic and social links with our alma mater. In the last one year, several meetings were held and during our first formal organizing committee meeting of AIMCA UK in Manchester on 28th December, interestingly in the same place, and that meeting was attended by several AIMC graduates. It was decided to choose Dr. Ayaz Asghar as chief organizer and different subcommittees were formed. Now I would like to invite uh, the very important person of uh, MK UK as you know, uh, everything along with everything money matters. So he's our finance secretary, 
Dr. Naveed Hug. He is also a consultant uh, psychiatrist as well. I would request Dr. Naveed Hug to come to stage, please. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. मेरी आवाज आप सब तक पहुंच रही है पीछे? Thank you. हमारे शहर में हमारे शहर में सब मेहरबान आए हैं। हमें है हुक्म कि नजरों को मुहतरम कर लें। बहुत मुहतरम मेहमान आने ग्रामी और बहुत ही अजीज अक्वालियंस। मैं यहाँ से यहाँ पे आपसे दो बातें शेयर करने के लिए आया हूँ। आपका ज़्यादा वक्त नहीं लूँगा। पहली बात ये है कि हमारे बहुत ही मुहतरम दो उस्ताद जनाब प्रोफेसर इफ्तार अहमद साहब हमसे जुदा हो गए हैं उनका नाम तिब की दुनिया में और हमारे कॉलेज की हिस्ट्री में सबको याद रहेगा उनके लिए डॉक्टर जवेद काजी साहब ने कुछ शेर लिखे थे तो उन्होंने मुझे ये फर्ज सौंपा है कि मैं वो आप तक पहुंचा दूं उन्होंने लिखा है कि फिजाए तिब में खुशबुएं बसा गया एक शख्स लरसते चरागों को सितारे बना गया एक शख्स कहकशा नजरों में ऐसी बसा गया एक शख्स दियारे जुल्मत के सब निशान मिटा गया एक शख्स जगमगा उठा हर कल उसकी रोशन गुरबत से सोच के अंधेरों में चरा वैसे जला गया एक शख्स और आखिर उन्होंने लिखा है कि कहानी के हर मोड़ पे जो हंसाता ही रहा आखिरी मंजर में सबको रुला गया वो शख्स सबसे पहली बात यह कि हमने अकाउंट जो शुरू किया था वो हमने मार्च में अकाउंट ओपन किया था आफ्टर कपल ऑफ मीटिंग्स हेयर एंड देयर अब तक हमारे पास दो एक्टिव मेंबर्स हैं जो मंथली पे कर रहे हैं उनमें एक डॉक्टर शाहिद शरीफ साहब हैं आई एम वेरी थैंकफुल कि वो हमारे सबसे पहले एक बालियन हैं कि जिन्होंने इस काम में हिस्सा डाला दूसरी बात हमारे पास चार ऐसे मेंबर हैं जो उन्होंने लाइफ मेंबरशिप ली है उसका मतलब यह है कि उन्होंने अपने 10 सालों की मेंबरशिप इन एडवांस जमा करवा दी है जो कि महीने के 10 पाउंड बनते हैं 10 साल के 1200 पाउंड उन लोगों ने डिपॉजिट करवा दिए हैं उनमें डॉक्टर याज असख डॉक्टर दिल सवान साहब डॉक्टर उस्मान खान साहब और मैं शामिल हूँ मेरी आप लोगों से मेरी आप लोगों से गुजारिश है कि या तो आप लाइफ मेंबर बने और दूसरी बात यह कि या एटलीस्ट मंथली मेंबरशिप जरूर अडॉप्ट करें क्योंकि आप लोगों के तावन की हमें बहुत जरूरत रहेगी इसमें एक और चीज बता दूं कि जो भी कंट्रीब्यूशन इकट्ठी होंगी वो सब की सब आइर तो हमारे कॉलेज के लिए या वहाँ के स्टूडेंट्स के लिए या हॉस्पिटल के लिए और वहाँ से ग्रेजुएट होने वाले दोस्तों के लिए ही इस्तेमाल होगा जितने एक्टिव मेंबर होंगे वो किसी भी वक्त मुझसे रबता करें अयास साहब से रबता करें या हमारी कमेटी से रबता करें हम उनको अकाउंट्स विद इन शॉर्ट नोटिस शो करेंगे किसी भी वक्त इसलिए इट विल बी अ वेरी ट्रांसपेरेंट मैकेजम सो आपके पैसे के ज़ाय होने का कोई अंदेशा नहीं है कि जितने भी लोग हैं वो खुद कंट्रीब्यूट कर रहे हैं सो दे आर नॉट गोइंग टू टेक एनी पेनी अवे फ्रॉम यू और जाने से पहले पाकिस्तान के हालात उसी तरह के हैं उससे बिगड़ चुके हैं तो उसके लिए एक दुआ है जो अहमद नदीम कासमी साहब ने लिखी थी कुछ साल पहले मेरा दिल कर रहा है कि मैं आपको वो आपके साथ शेयर कर लूँ कि खुदा करे कि मेरी अर्ज पाक पर उतरे खुदा करे कि मेरी अर्ज पाक पर उतरे वो फसल गुल जिसे अंदेशा मलाल ना हो यहाँ जो फूल खिला यहाँ जो फूल खिले वो खिला रहे यहाँ खजां को गुजरने की मजाल ना हो यहाँ जो सब्जा उगे वो हमेशा सब्ज रहे और ऐसा सब्ज कि उसकी मिसाल ना हो खुदा करे कि वकार उसका गैर फानी हो और उसके हुस्न को तशवीश माहो साल ना हो खुदा करे कि मेरी अर्ज पाक पर उतरे वो फसल गुल जिसे अंदेशा एक जवाल ना थैंक यू अस्सलाम वालेकुम नेक्स्ट आई वुड लाइक टू इनवाइट डॉक्टर इद्रीस अवान टू कम एंड शेयर विद अस द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ऑफ एम का यूके डॉक्टर इद्रीस अवान इज अ कंसल्टेंट यूरोलॉजिस्ट एंड ही अलोंग विद डॉक्टर उस्मान खान एंड डॉक्टर एयाज असगर हैव पुट देयर इयर्स ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस टू फॉर्मुलेट अ वेरी नाइस एंड ऑर्गेनाइज कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन फॉर एम का यूके सर बिसमिल्लाम 
I start by the name of God, most gracious, most merciful. Our most popular and respected teacher and our chief guest for this evening, Professor Shahina Asif, our chairperson, Dr. Yaz Asghar, our member of parliament, Afzal, European Parliament, Afzal Khan, and Sajid Mahmood Qadi Saab, all of my colleagues, ladies and gentlemen. It is a very nice feeling to be with so many colleagues under one roof who are enjoying this wonderful evening along with their families. I am very happy to see Professor Shaina Asif today. I don't know whether you remember me or not, it's been more than 35 years now. Dr. Saiba, because of your personality, your charm, your style of teaching, in very few uh, days, you talk, took over hearts and minds of all senior clinical students of Elam Iqbal Medical College. And who are the key people who will run this constituency, this organization? That's the member. As Naveed has already member, uh, mentioned, there needs to be act, active, active member, number one, number two, as the associate member, number three, honorary member, number four, student member, and number five, member emeritus. Hopefully, Professor, Professor Saiba will be our uh, uh, member in, in future. And who is going to run, who is going to run the day-to-day -day matter of the organization? There will be 15 people who will run the day-to-day -day, uh, matter of the organization, and that will be uh, selected by the uh, members, or active, active members. And they, as a whole, they will be called executive members. And that's how you know that they are the important people on whom we have to keep an eye on them. So out of 15, four will be of the bear, our chairperson, general secretary, finance secretary, and social secretary. And four will be regional leads. And there four will be mentor and education leads. And the remaining three will be uh, other committees head. Madam, there are 15 people, they will run this association. And I know there are less than 15 people around the country. And these are the educated people, they can effectively run the, this organization. I am very happy. Uh, <laughs> Madam, you see, now you know, we know how to deal with the patient and deal with the people also. And I know many of my colleagues already involved in charitable work, including Dr. Yaz Asghar, Dr. Shahid Shreve, Dr. Usman Khan, Nayyar Abdi, and, Dr., uh, and many others who support, support us. And I myself, I chair three charitable medical organizations, including one Hashim Welfare Hospital in the rural area of the Pakistan, and I mentor myself three charitable hospitals in Pakistan, one of which is run by one of our Iqbalian colleagues in the Faisalabad. So, madam, we are not as naughty, as bad as we used to be in our student life. <laughs> we, we want to become responsible doctor. <laughs> we want to be still responsible doctor and reasonable human being who look after our patients, our people, our parents, and our, our teachers. Please pray for our success in our alumni and our projects. Thank you very much. Alami Pan Medical College, Mohsini Millet Hakim al Umar Dr. Alama Iqbal Rahmatullah Alayhi, Aapke Naam Pe, Izahari Akidat Ki Khatir Rajit Yaseen Ke Liye, Kalama Iqbal Ki Dhoti Nishar Pe Shakir Mathe. Tu Abhi Raag Kudar Ne Hai, Kaya De Makaan,
बदाओ जान से गुजर Organizer Dr. Ayaz Askar to come to stage and say a few words about alumni. Thank you very much. Uh, dear Iqbalians, ladies and gentlemen, Madam Shaina Asif, our chief guest, and other dignitaries. Good evening and Assalamu Alaikum. Dear Iqbalians, I'm very delighted today to see. A such a good response from you at this first Amica UK anniversary gala dinner. By attending this event in such a big number, you made yourself a proud Iqbalian and you all deserve a pat at the shoulder. And I would give a big round of applause for you. Graduates of Philama Iqbal Medical College have been uh, serving NHS for the last 25 years and uh, we did not have any structured forum uh, in UK to represent ourselves and although there were some sporadic uh, alumni activities over these years but uh, there was no structured platform where we can come together and engage socially or academically. Dr. Irfan Rashid and Dr. Harris, Dr. Aisha over the last few years have uh, successfully uh, organized alumni which uh, has resulted into formation of this Amica UK. Last year, June, we had a successful dinner in London where on my proposal this uh, structured forum was formed which was named Amica UK. And since then, we have been trying very hard to generate the interest of Iqbalians. We had numerous meetings up and down the country, and, uh, and we organized uh, our event here today. Everybody has worked very hard, and I would congratulate the event management committee who has worked tirelessly to put this event together. And uh, over the six months period, we have achieved few things which we are proud of because there were only five, six months and we have uh, tried to establish a constitution which Adris have updated you and uh, we have uh, formed a teaching and training committee which is headed by Professor Ahmed and I would encourage all Iqbalians to contribute towards it and, could, and you could spare some time and your expertise and let us know if you want to join this committee. We have also launched uh, another project on the Amica platform that is International Medical Graduate Sponsor Sponsorship Scheme and uh, I would also ask you to support this project. Dr. Zia Khan is the focal person for this project and uh, if you are interested please do get in touch with him. Today, on this forum, we are also launching our first public health awareness project with the cooperation of the Asian Sound Radio. And today, our uh, Iqbalian colleagues will be interviewed on uh, different topics of public interest. 
in future our motto is to reach out to every Kabbalian in UK and I would ask your help to please spread the message across to all the doctors, Iqbalians in UK who are not part of this activity today and they can forward us their recent email addresses. The other achievement we have made is establish, establishing in the history of Amica UK the first website and in future we would try to start a blast email system which will help us to communicate with our Amica UK colleagues in UK. Lastly, this is my responsibility to thank uh, our chief guest, Madam, you have taken the time and you've specially flown in and on behalf of the uh, organizing committee, I'm very thankful to you and your husband to come to you. I would take this opportunity to thank our head of alumni and uh, head of the associations today who has joined us today and uh, I'm, 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 I appreciate your support and I think this will go a long way our association in future inshallah. I would also like to thank our uh, media friends, uh, Geo TV, Apex TV and our print media, Talas Saab, Afzal Saab, Lodi Saab and the Seva. I would also like to thank our proud Iqbalian Dr. Nayyar Abdi who has been given MBE by the Royal and he has also been appointed recently as a Deputy Lieutenant of Greater Manchester. I congratulate you and you are a proud Iqbalian. <laughs> Lastly, I would like to thank our two sponsors today. One is the GP Medical Locums. Azan, Mr. Azan, and second is Dean uh, Sullivan Accountants, who has helped us to uh, run this event for you. And our event uh, management committee has lined up a very interesting program, and I would, uh, uh, I will hope you will enjoy the evening. And thank you very much. Allah Hafiz. Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Ayaz Askar. Only an ophthalmologist could have the eye to identify such a potential and transform it, uh, this organization into a strong, well-structured alumni. Last but not the least, can I request Madam Shaheen Asif to come to stage and say a few words. Thank you very much, Madam. इकबालियंस के लिए ही अलामा इकबाल ने कहा था परवाज है दोनों की इसी एक फजा में करगस का जहां और है शाही का जहां और तो आप शाहीन हैं अलामा इकबाल मेडिकल कॉलेज के और आज मैं यहां आकर बहुत बहुत ज्यादा खुश हूं आप सब लोग मुझे बेइंतहा अजीज हैं اس کا اندازہ آپ اس بات سے لگائیں کہ میں کافی عرصے سے بیمار تھی I had an angiography and then I took Lipitor and I had some liver disease because of Lipitor and then it's a long story and I wasn't well enough to travel but I did and I wanted to do it not for you but for myself because Alama Iqbal Medical College کے students نے جتنی خوشی اور جتنی محبت مجھے دی ہے وہ مجھے کہیں سے بھی اپنے بچوں سے بھی کبھی نہیں ملی آپ سب میرے لئے بہت عزیز ہیں علامہ اقبال میڈیکل کالج کا پہلا دن مجھے بہت اچھی طرح یاد ہے عثمان یہاں بیٹھے ہیں اور صحیح دلائی بھی کہیں ہوں گے یہ دونوں لڑکے شاید انہوں نے کسی اور لڑکے کو کہا اور میرا وہ پہلا دن تھا اور میں نے پوچھا ان لڑکوں سے کہ پروفیسر افتخار کا کمرہ کون سا ہے I'm sure کہ انہوں نے ان دونوں لڑکوں کو کہا تھا اور وہ آکے مجھے ایک جگہ پہ جاڑیوں کے پیچھے کھڑے کر گئے 
और मुझे कहा कि आप जो भी बंदा बाहर आए उससे ये पूछिएगा कि डॉक्टर इफ्तार फारग हो गए हैं और फिर आपने अंदर जाना है वरना आप अंदर गए तो बहुत नाराज़ होंगे अब मैं घंटा वहाँ खड़ी हुई हूँ जीन्स मैंने पहनी हुई थी ब्राउन और सीधी लंदन से मैं लैंड हुई थी और वालद साहब ने कहा था कि अब तुमने वापस नहीं जाना और वो एक्चुअली बॉयज़ का बाथरूम था वॉशरूम था अब मैं जो लड़का बाहर आता है मैं कहती हूँ डॉक्टर इफ्तार फारग हो गए हैं वो कहते हैं वो मुझे घूरते और फिर बुरी तरह तरह देख के चले जाते आखिर में एक बेचारा शरीफ सा लड़का कोई आ रहा था उसने कहा आप यहाँ क्यों खड़ी हैं मैंने कहा मैंने डॉक्टर इफ्तार से मिलना है उसने फिर मुझे गाइड किया और डॉक्टर इफ्तार के कमरे में मैं गई अल्लाह ताला उनको जन्नत नसीब करी उनका सफ़ेद रंग का सूट और लाल रंग का फूल लगाए वो वहाँ बैठे थे और एक मजमा सा था जिसमें प्रोफेसर अपने रियाज अहसन सदीकी साहब भी बैठे थे मैं अंदर गई और मैंने कहा सर मैं यहाँ मेरी अपॉइंटमेंट हुई है एज असटेंट प्रोफेसर तो उन्होंने पहले मुझे ऊपर नीचे देखा और फिर कहा पढ़ा लें दो काकी मैं क्या जी सर मैंने कभी पढ़ाया नहीं है तो कहते अच्छा नहीं पढ़ाया बंदरा नु पढ़ा लोगे मैं क्या सर मैं इंशाला नहीं पढ़ाया मैं बंदरा नु किस तरह पढ़ा बहरहाल वो दिन और आज का दिन Uh, मुझे पढ़ने का बहुत शौक़ था और पढ़ाने का भी बहुत शौक़ था और डॉक्टर इफ्तार ने कहा कि तुम ऐसे करना मेरी क्लास में आके बैठ जाना और देखना कि पढ़ाते कैसे हैं मैं कहा जी ठीक है मैं उनकी क्लास में गई और डॉक्टर इफ्तार पता नहीं कौन से आप लोगों के कौन सा बैच था उसको वो पढ़ा रहे थे माओकार्डियल इन्फाक्शन और उनका पढ़ने पढ़ाने का स्टाइल ये था पुत्रो एटीओलॉजी ऑफ माओकार्डियल इन्फाक्शन रिमेंबर खोते नो हार्ट अटैक नहीं होता <laughs> अब मैं पीछे बैठी थी मैंने कहा ये क्या कह रहे हैं खोते को हार्ट अटैक नहीं होता फिर उन्होंने बताया खोता मेहनत करता है खोता घास खाता है खोता सोचता नहीं है उसका दिमाग नहीं होता एंड आई थॉट वट अ वंडरफुल टीचर एंड यू हैव टू ब्रिंग योर सेल्फ डाउन टू बांदर्स टू टीच दैम लाइक बांदर्स so that day you know i learned so much from uh, professor iftikhar that he was a friend to all of you and the first thing i learned about teaching was that you don't uh, demand respect you get respect by being part of uh, uh, you know the students and you teach them and you are part of them kabhi mere samosa kha jate the kabhi mujhe kehte the हमारी क्रिकेट की गेंद घूम गई रोज मेरे से क्रिकेट की गेंद के पैसे लेते थे और थिंग्स लाइक दैट सो इट वाज रियली अ लॉट ऑफ फन एंड आई एम सो हैप्पी टू बी हियर थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर इनवाइटिंग मी एंड आई वांट कीप यू अवे फ्रॉम योर डिनर एंड फ्रॉम योर लवली प्रोग्राम थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर आस्किंग मी टू कम थैंक यू मैम शाहिना से कैन यू प्लीज रिक्वेस्ट मिस्टर अफसल खान ex lord mayor of manchester and newly elected member of european parliament to come on the stage and to say a few words please thank you bismillah rahman rahim my brothers and sisters assalam alaikum and may i apologize for being late i was in rochdale with another function uh, but after uh, listening to the last speaker um, i wished she had carried on for another 5 minutes she was amazing speaker actually mixing uh, very serious message and also a lot of humor in there as well uh khushi to is baat ki bhi ho rahi hai ke we are got here of the uh, all the people the medical profession from alama ikbal ikbal uh, medical uh, center you know i don't have much experience of pakistan in that context but i know one thing the alhamdulillah the best service in the world is the health service and the pakistani doctor is certainly keeping it alive keeping it going and making it go forward so please put to, uh, your hands together for all those wonderful doctors in the medical profession who do a wonderful job main ek aur cheez se fayda khate hue log introduction mein kaha tha ki i was a newly elected uh, member of european parliament main samjhta hu ke jo pakistani yahan pe baad hain उनके लिए ये फख्र की बात है इस पे नहीं है सिंपली कि मैं एक बना हूँ लेकिन 
فخر کی بات یہ ہے کہ اس بار ہمارے پاس تین ہیں تو جب الیکشن کی کمپین ہو رہی تھی تو اس پہ بات تھا میں نے یہ پہلے دن یہ بات کہی تھی کہ ایک ایک ہوتا ہے دو ایک یارہ ہوتے ہیں تو الحمدللہ آپ کے بائی بہنوں کی تعاون سے برطانیہ میں دو یارہ کی بات نہیں ہے ایک سو یارہ کی بات ہے تین ہوئے ہیں تو اس کے لیے بھی تعلیم ضرور ہونی چاہیے You know, as a politician, you also know one thing, never stay between food and the people. So I need to stop that and I really want to once again thank our special guest uh, who is here from all the way from Pakistan. And like I said, you know, when I was listening to her, I thought amazing, Professor Shaina Asif Saab, that you were amazing what you did and what you said. I honestly love your speech. Inshallah, I look forward to having you again and working with you. Thank you very much. Thank you for asking me to give some comments on our organization, MK UK. We have recently launched it to promote our college fellows from Alam Iqbal Medical College to give support to the new uh, young doctors coming from Alam Iqbal Medical College to UK and going abroad and also provide support with the projects happening in Jinnam Hospital and Alam Iqbal Medical College. Uh, we will help with the uh, further education with organizing any training sessions and with medical help in all the fields of medicine and surgery here and back home to our young generation. My name is Professor Shahina Asif and I'm a gynecologist and I've traveled all the way from Pakistan to be with the, my Alama Iqbal uh, college students, ex-students and uh, it's a great function and uh, uh, everybody's having a great time. It's so nice to see that uh, my graduates have done so well in life and they are now heading uh, many institutions uh, in their own uh, fields and they're doing so much good for Britain. On the other hand, they're also doing charity work in Pakistan, uh, which is really nice. Off and on they come to Pakistan to bring new technology and I hope and I pray that they will become stronger and more effective in the future. The reason we arrange this event, uh, uh, as other people have mentioned, that uh, the graduates from Alam Iqbal Medical College, uh, they're working in this country and serving NHS for over two decades. And we didn't have any strong platform. We used to run or used to organize a small get together so we can raise the awareness that we need a strong platform. So the reason to make this platform so we can serve our country, we can serve our mother institute, Alam Iqbal Medical College. Our main aim is to help the new doctors which are coming from Pakistan and to help them as much as we can so that they don't face the difficulties which we have already faced as new doctors here and to help the doctors back home, to help them with their studies if they cannot afford and also to meet each other as a family. So we look forward to expanding this organization and put as much effort into it and make it a better organization in future. I'm delighted to be here tonight uh, at this dinner of Alama Iqbal Medical College alumni all have come together. It's wonderful to see uh, how many of these Pakistani doctors actually have worked hard and then made a progress, many of them specializing, and here they are in Britain supporting the NHS, which is one of the best institutions of world renowned. And not only that they are contributing and maintaining and taking it forward, the NHS here, but they are also contributing and sharing their expertise with the tomorrow's future leaders which are in Pakistan's developing in the medical profession. Bismillah rahman rahim First of all, I would like to thank uh, Apex TV for coming here and covering Amica UK's uh, program. Uh, this is our first uh, annual dinner. Uh, after we have formed this organization. Now this is an association called Alama Iqbal Medical College Alumni UK. And we have uh, done all the constitution and all the doctors are here now. Most of the doctors who are working in UK, they are here. And our aims are just to promote cooperation between uh, our colleagues, social and professional cooperation, and also medical education in Pakistan and in in the UK and also help Alama Iqbal young graduates who become young doctors and come here in the UK to help them. Today gathering was uh, anniversary celebrate, first anniversary celebrated by the Amica UK and this uh, platform is to 
bring the Iqbalians in UK together for uh, socialization and uh, academic interaction. We would uh, try to support our junior Iqbalians in this uh, country and we would try to establish a link with our alma mater in Pakistan and we would try to train and uh, give some expertise in uh, Jinnah Hospital and Allah Iqbal Medical College and uh, try to support whatever we can in their ongoing projects in Jinnah Hospital. Hi, I'm uh, Mr. and Mrs. Suhail. Uh, we are both Iqbalians. It's a wonderful event, very well organized. And I think that this event Iqbalians should be more than ever. It's a very good chance to meet, to network, and it's also good that we can do more work in the future and can increase our college. And I think that we will be able to do more research and audit collaboration and get our own journal. I'm from Pakistan, Punjab, Kujar Khan. और इसके अलावा मैं हरिस्वी में यहाँ पर हरिस्वी में रहता हूँ जितने किरण चार साल हुए यहाँ पर आए हुए और बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया एक दफा डॉक्टर यास्कर जी ने मौका दिया हमें स्टेज पर इतने खूबसूरत लोगों के सामने एक मेरी आप उसे कह रहे हैं कि पता नहीं अच्छी आदत है कि बुरी आदत है कि जब भी मैं स्टेज पे चढ़ता हूँ जब भी मैं स्टेज पे खड़ा आता हूँ तो मैं अपनी ऑडियंस को अपने साथ चला के रखता हूँ हमेशा क्योंकि मुझे उसमें मजा आता है और ऑडियंस को भी मजा आता है वरना अगर हम खड़े होकर यहाँ पर बोलते रहेंगे सिंगर्स गाते रहेंगे और आप अपने ध्यान में रहेंगे तो फिर मजा नहीं आएगा ना क्योंकि आपने ऑफ कोर्स पैसे स्पेंड किए होते हैं अपने टिकट्स पे ट्रैवलिंग पे और आपका टाइम भी बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट है राइट एक तो बस जोर से तालियां हो जाएं ताकि पता चले कि वाकई यहाँ पर हर भी बंदा जागर कम ऑन वन टू थ्री एक दफा ए a very talented artist, he came all the way from London. I was very proud of him. I had a show in Glasgow with him. I was very proud of him. I was very proud of him. When we are on stage, no one will come to stage. Please do it with your friends. I know that when you were in speeches, you were very calm. And you were sitting on two tables. I felt that when you were in the speakers, they were very proud of him. So please, when your voice will not be able to hear you, I will not do the announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Ali Imran. Come on! Ali Imran, come on! Ali Imran, Ali Imran, come on!
जो मर्जी बन जाए जिंदगी में आप पाकिस्तानी रहेंगे आप बाद में शायद मुस्लिम है या क्रिश्चियन है या हिंदू है आप पाकिस्तानी पहले हैं क्योंकि वो आपकी आइडेंटिटी है तो मैं अपने पाकिस्तान के बारे में आप सबके बारे में यही कहूंगा कि गुलशन की फकत फूलों से नहीं कांटों से भी जीनत होती है गुलशन की फकत फूलों से नहीं कांटों से भी जीनत होती है जिंदगी में जिंदा रहने के लिए थोड़े गम की भी जरूरत होती है तो करता है एक कयामत का चर्चा यहाँ रोज निगाहें मिलती हैं यहाँ रोज कयामत थैंक यू वेरी मच दुआ में याद कीजिएगा कहा सुना माँ अगर किसी को मेरी कोई बात बुरी लगी हो आई डोंट केयर मेरा काम ही है सर